Uh, once again, the team showed a lot of heart. Um, still didn't play well, didn't shoot the ball well. Uh, we let them dribble drive us all night, um, but we found a way to win. Uh, needless to say, Esmeri, 24 rebounds, was big for us. You know, Kari is in foul trouble. And, uh, you know, we just got to get a little bit more balanced. Uh, Kaiser had the nerve to shoot that three and, and put us up five. You know, thank goodness she hit it, but she, she has the guts to shoot that and uh, hit a big shot for us. Questions for Coach? We'll start with Joe, go ahead. Mike, in the second half, were you guys just not making a conscious effort to get the ball inside? It seemed like you were settling for jumpers a lot. Were there opportunities inside that weren't going as they should have? Well, I thought, you know, there was a stretch where Esmeri had about five shots on one uh, trip. And then, you know, but you know what? The post got to want the ball, too. I mean, they, they got to sit down and demand the ball and, and uh, not defer to the guards. You know, I even try to run some stuff for the post, but, you know, they act like they didn't want the ball in there. But to answer your question, yes, we got to get the ball inside. Kari can score, Esmeri can score. Blessing did a great job off the bench today. So, I mean, those are things we got to do, become more balanced. We'll go to Joe again. Go ahead. You mentioned blessing and she gives you eight in the first half. How important how important was she to what, what you guys are doing? Joe, say your question one more time. You think you get eight in the first half from her? How Who did? Blessing. Blessing? Yes. Yeah, that was big. That you you were breaking up. That's why I couldn't hear you. Uh yeah, that was big. That eight points from her. We needed that because Kari, like I said, was in foul trouble. Blessing come in and did a good job. Carly, go ahead. Coach, you said after last game that you were looking for your source of energy without Maddie. Do you think Esmeri kind of provided that today? Oh, I, I think Esmeri. I thought KK Deans too. Man, she was in everybody's ear. She she was playing hard. She was diving on the floor. She was doing all the little stuff that Maddie usually does. So very proud of her too in the little stuff. Joe, go ahead. Mike, going into a game knowing you're going to be limited on the bench and not have a lot of players to go to, how has that affected what you guys do leading up to games? Do you have practices short a little bit or anything differently? I mean, it's hurting us, especially on the perimeter. Uh, yeah, I mean, we got to cut back a little bit, getting a little sloppy. We're, we're not as, I mean, we, did, we didn't guard the ball at all today. And, and that's something that, you know, we normally do a good job of. So, you know, we, we got to guard dribble drive a lot better than what we did today. Last one from Corley, go ahead. Coach, you said Kaiser had the nerve to take that shot as if it was like a bad connotation, but I'm sure you you like yeah. the result of that shot. We kind of want something downhill, you know what I mean? It's like that. It's like the old story. She takes that shot, and I'm thinking in my mind, terrible shot. Should have got downhill when it goes in. I say, great shot. You know, one of those deals. But hey, she has the nerve to do that, and and, and great players do that. Great players think they're going to make every shot. And so, you know, she hit a big shot down the stretch. All right. Thanks, Coach.